What is going on, XRP Army? Guys, the day that you're waiting for is just, it's right here, okay? It's so close, and I'm gonna tell you why. And I know that some of you have been holding on for a long period of time, and you're in this 50 to 60 cent range, and you're thinking like, oh my God, will it just please absolutely break out or something? Why? So you can sell? It doesn't really matter. If you just relax and just have a little patience with it, there's something brewing, something happening that's gonna change the dynamic of XRP. And if you like this type of content, make sure you hit the like button on your way in because this is about to get very, very serious. All right, guys, the news started with Grayscale about three weeks ago putting the first XRP trust out here. Now, this just allows, this is not people investing in XRP. This is just uh, Grayscale giving you, the investor, the opportunity to invest in companies that have exposure to XRP. There's no XRP actually in it. However, this is how the Bitcoin ETF started. So this is a reason for you to get super excited. Now, long term, is it something that's going to just absolutely explosively pump the chart? No, this is laying the foundation, okay? So we laid the foundation about three weeks ago, and then 24 hours ago, boom, Bitwise has made an XRP ETF plan. It has submitted an S1 filing, and the filing comes after the asset manager on Tuesday registered a trust with the state of Delaware, the first hint of its intentions, and we knew that it was coming. We knew that the possibility was there, and then it actually happened. So now, what do we do? Well, there is one piece of the equation that we're still awaiting, and you might be looking at the chart today, and you're saying, well, if all of this is happening, why is it dipping? Hey, good question, genius. Let me answer that for you. The SEC still has until October 7 to file an appeal. Now, when would that appeal be filed? Now, look, the, the, the SEC at this point, Gary Gensler is a shady, shady person, okay? So when do you think that a shady, shady person would drop that filing Friday as we get to the end of business? Because what they want to do is they want to let it settle in over the weekend and they want to do something, which is this is not a popular move if they were to appeal it. And if they were to do that, then they want to do it in a place where they don't have to deal with press. They all walk away because Karine Jean-Pierre, whatever that lady's name is, uh, she won't be sitting at the podium for a couple of days and you won't be taking questions. So other news could then kind of absorb and, and turn it into something. You know what I mean? Like just, it's, it's one of those things where that's what they do. When you're a shady, seedy, scummy sort of part of the U.S. government, those are the moves that you make. And it's called the Friday dump. So I would expect to see if they, if they do file an appeal that it's going to be at that period of time. But that would also make Gary Gensler a lying Call him what you want, but he was he, that would make him a liar. Why would it make him a liar? Because once the ruling was handed out that the SEC uh, had, had gotten approved for a $125 million penalty from XRP, because there is no disgorgement, by the way, uh, but, but when that happened, what happened after that? The XRP, the, the SEC said, oh, we're incredibly happy with this ruling. Now, if they're not happy with this ruling, that makes Gary Gensler a liar. Now, is Gary Gensler a liar? You know, and I know the answer to that. We're not going to say it on YouTube because who knows whether Gary Gensler is an investor in Google. You never know what will happen there. But um, so we, we do have a couple days and, and there is downward momentum. Now, let's check the, the price action on the chart. So from a chart perspective, for the last three days, we've had downward momentum. Why is that? Well, the broader market is what the downward momentum is coming from, and that is because Bitcoin has been absolutely dumping and coming down super, super hard. So, And that's what's happening right here, and that's what you're witnessing and experiencing. So that is just an, an absolutely wild level of, of dump that's happening right now. XRP is still at 58 cents. I mean, when in doubt, zoom out, right? We're looking at a daily chart. Like we've been at 40 cents not that long ago. So uh, to come into this range, even to come down to 52 cents, by the way, is still a very positive indicator because we have this level. Now we broke back into the channel. I told you guys we had to break out of it and didn't break out. That doesn't mean that we won't. 
But the more likely scenario here is for most of the market, by the way, uh, kind of moving down into this range and then trying to get a successful bounce off of that. If not, coming down into this range at 52 cents and then making a successful bounce and retest off of that. But then eventually breaking out, it's in, we're in October, we're at the beginning of the month, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, but uh, we, we should know that, we should recognize that. And let me show you where the liquidity is. And let me show you this thing. And, and look, I don't think that we talk about this nearly enough. So we're gonna do it today. This is what your liquidation heat map looks like right now for XRP on the monthly. Now, if we look at it on shorter time frames, we'll see a little bit difference. But what I'm trying to get at right here is if you would just grant here that that market makers are looking for liquidity, they're looking for the market to do certain moves, and they're looking to, to, to liquidate your longs and shorts. Well, that means that somewhere in this 56 range, which is exactly where I said all the way down to 55.1, which happens to be like right there, uh, at the bottom of that liquidity pool, let me go back here, 55.4 right there. Uh, that's basically where we are on this chart. If I come down here, 55.4 comes into right there at the bottom of this liquidity range. So that's what you would expect to see happen. And then you would expect to see reversal coming after that. Now, if we go to the weekly and we look at the weekly, we've already swept through and we've already grabbed that liquidity. So if you see the downward push, if you notice, we grab liquidity, right here, then we got a nice little resurgence and then boom, dumped back down, which means that we're most likely heading down into getting this. And look, if, if you're if you're leverage trading, be worried about some downward momentum. But if you're not leverage trading and you're just hodling, you are absolutely fine. And if you are looking to do leverage trading and you're looking for a place in order to safely do leverage trading, May I introduce you to Margex? The link is in the description down below. I have three different companies that I work for over here. You can see them in the, the, the Chiron down at the bottom. But uh, Margex, if you are looking to do trading, Margex is your place to go. Uh, there's a link in the description down below. They do futures trading up to 100x leverage on XRP. That's a big number right now. And you can get up to $10,000 in bonuses just by signing up at Margex today and making a deposit. So what are you waiting for? Go sign up at Margex today. Also, Bitwise, XRP ETF, Grayscale, ETF, uh, XRP ETF Trust, uh, Market, dipping just a little bit before ripping. Look, I told you guys it was going to happen. You didn't believe me. You said October, we're going to go up, 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 up only. I told you no. Here we are. So um, you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below. Get yourself a bag of XRP. You're, you're, look, I'm telling you, $25 is where XRP is going to end up at least. So uh, if you haven't already, pack a bag because it's about time. It's not financial advice, but I'm always right. Cryptonomy has over 600 digital assets for you to swap, store, and trade. Cryptonomy is doing a giveaway for $1,000 in your fixed staking deposit, you will randomly receive a bonus of between $50 and $5,000. All right, folks, we're going for six months this time, 29.6 APY. Contract has been created. Guys, Cryptonomy at this point should be your main staking platform. And that's because of the dynamic rewards that have been available from the launch pool. Folks, sign up for cryptonomy.finance today. Start staking, start earning.